Welcome to World Action and Reaction News, today we discuss Chinese latest stealth fighter Chengdu J-20, new super warplane for China. China's latest stealth fighter, the J-20, is serving in the People's Liberation Army Air Force, according to state media. Military Sukers said the appearance of J-20s in the Air Force was meant as a warning to Japan and South Korea, which are expected to buy US F-35 stealth fighters now that China has equally advanced warplanes. Video footage aired by CCTV March 9, 2017 showed J-20 fighters alongside PLAY-20 transport planes and H-6K bombers. The broadcast did not say how many J-20s were operational. Most sources refer to the J-20 as the Black Eagle, but a non-trivial number use the nomenclature Black Silk, while some call it Mighty Dragon. It resembles neither the American Raptor F-22, nor the Russian T-50 Pak Fa. In August 2008 it was reported that 611 Institute Chengdu Aircraft Design Institute was selected to be the main contractor for the development of the fifth-generation stealthy J-20 and that 601 Institute Shenyang Aircraft Corporation SAC was the subcontractor. It was rumored that 611 Institute has started to issue manufacturing drawings for constructing the first prototype, which was expected to fly by 2012, even though the full configuration one won't fly until a few years later. The latest rumor suggested that a full-scale mock-up had been built at CAC. In August 2008, a RAND study raised questions about the ability of U.S. tactical aircraft, including the F-22, to counter large numbers of Chinese aircraft in a Taiwan Strait scenario. Though at that time the F-22 was assumed to be able to shoot down 48 Chinese flankers when outnumbered 12-1 without loss, this did not take into account less than perfect U.S. beyond visual range performance or possible deployment of a new Chinese stealth fighter around 2020 or 2025. One of the most significant revelations coming out of the 8th China International Aviation and Aerospace Exhibition, held in Zhuhai, Guangdong Province between November 16 and 21, 2010 also known as Airshow China 2010 was official confirmation of the existence of two parallel R&D programs aimed at fielding a fourth-generation multi-role combat aircraft MRCA, the Jian J-14, by 2014, and the fifth-generation Jian J-20 air dominance combat aircraft by 2018. Both these new generation combat aircraft are being developed by the PLA Air Force's NOS 601 and 611 Institute, with Chengdu Aircraft Corps plant NO132, CAC, acting as the prime industrial contractor. The J-20 will be powered by twin uprated WS-10GS, each of which will offer a maximum thrust of 155 knots. It was on November 9 that the PLA Air Force's deputy commander, General He Weirong, confirmed the existence of both the J-14 and J-20 by saying that the former will soon be rolled out, while the latter will begin entering service by 2018. The J-20's design will be characterized by 3S capabilities, stealth, super cruise, super maneuverability, and short takeoff. In a speech delivered by Secretary of Defense Robert M. Gates, Economic Club of Chicago, July 16, 2009, he stated by 2020, the United States is projected to have nearly 2,500 manned combat aircraft of all kinds. Of those, nearly 1,100 will be the most advanced fifth-generation F-35S and F-22S. China, by contrast, is projected to have no fifth-generation aircraft by 2020. And by 2025, the gap only widens. The U.S. will have approximately 1,700 of the most advanced fifth-generation fighters versus a handful of comparable aircraft for the Chinese. In 2009, General He Weirong, deputy commander of the People's Liberation Army Air Force estimated that the J-20 would be operational no earlier than in 2017-2019. On December 29, 2010, the right estimable China Defense blog published the first no-kidding photographs of the long-rumored JXX Chinese stealth fighter. 
Unambiguous confirmation of the existence of this program will require re-evaluation of aircraft modernization efforts in a number of countries, including Taiwan, South Korea, Japan, and the United States. Chinese combat aviation had made remarkable strides in recent years, moving from a collection of obsolete aircraft that would have provided a target-rich environment to potential adversaries. Today China flies hundreds of first-rate aircraft, and even flies more Sukhoi flankers the aircraft the American F-22 was designed to counter than does Russia. The Chinese stealth fighter has arrived right on schedule. Chinese military technology is generally rated about two decades behind that of the United States. While the advent of a Chinese counterpart to the F-22 fighter might be disconcerting, the first flight of the prototype American F-22 stealth fighter came on September 29, 1990. On January 11, 2011, President Hu Jintao confirmed that the prototype J-20 aircraft had made its maiden flight at around 1 p.m. that day. The flight coincided with a visit to China by U.S. Secretary of Defense Robert Gates. The flight was reported to have lasted 20 minutes, during which the aircraft was tailed by two J-10 fighters. Certain news accounts reported that the Chinese civilian leadership had been caught unaware by the timing of the flight. Beijing official news agency, Xinhua, published photos of the newest J-20 aircraft, coated in primer paint, in December 2015. An editorial published next to the photos proposed that the new stealth warplane has entered initial production. Xinhua noted that the serial number is an indication of that fact, as it has been changed from the 20XX designation of earlier iterations to 2101. But the news agency did not definitively state that the warplane has entered full production. The fighter, numbered 2101 on the fuselage, was painted a dull yellow primer coat. The low-rate initial production, LRIP, fighters would go to People's Liberation Army Air Force, PLOF, test pilots for flight testing. The prototype's appearance meant that most of the plane is likely frozen, design-wise, with no major changes anticipated. The plane has enjoyed visible improvements along the way. Prototype 3 featured redesigned air intakes, a less rounded, more angular nose, and an electro-optical targeting system. Prototypes 5 and 6 featured sharper strakes small winglets trailing the wings that mask the engine exhausts from radar. Wang Yunnan, Deputy Editor-in-Chief of Aerospace Knowledge Magazine, said January 16, 2016 the newest J-20 prototype must be tested to inspect technical changes designers made to it based on test results from earlier prototypes. He expected that the first of the J-20s will be delivered to the military around 2017. The J-20 could reach initial operational capability in 2017-2018 and China reportedly hoped to build 24 J-20s by 2020. The PLA Air Force views the J-20 as key to improving China's ability to conduct offensive operations to deny an enemy's chance to mobilize defensive forces. The J-20s stealth features and electronic warfare capabilities would degrade the ability of U.S. forces within the first island chain to detect and engage it. Thanks for watching. I hope you like this news. Please share your views in comment box. Please like and share this video. Press subscribe button and bell for auto update to you regarding my channel world action and reaction news, warn.